That is very fascinating what we uh, created 20 years ago uh, with Genelec. This, uh, on that time, very like an outstanding item, excellent home theater audio uh, loudspeaker. It was so great, and 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 now how it shaped the whole Genelec. How we then started to build like a family around this this item. It's very unbelievable. It's like a, a process you didn't, didn't guess at all when you when you made the first first proposals collaboration with Genelec. It's been very natural and very very uh, fluent. My role has been to give like a fresh thoughts and fresh ideas, some perspective what they m might ever thought about. And asking the silly questions uh, through the years and, and a bit like a challenging them as a team, since they are super good what they are doing. And then to, to have this, like a bit like this, like un unsecure things there that shall we try something, shall we do something what might surprise us. This dialogue has been very fruitful in many terms. Yeah, when, when then sculpting, sculpting this piece uh, more as it is today, it was like a, a great process with many professionals along how to fit components inside, how to have room enough for the components and where they should be. But that is maybe the, maybe the most enjoyable process as well in this this whole thing that that you can have this puzzle and, and you can you maybe might in, invent sort of things which were done before in a different way. So yeah that the first touch with uh, Genelec with the 6040 uh, some thoughts and then like a ready built mass produced 6040 and this evolution to the uh, Genelec ones that has been like a very unpredictable way to go. And as like an entrepreneur with your design studio, you, you don't have any idea how the collaboration is at the end. We, we need to start from so something. And in this case, we, we were able to, to, to really start from the sort of timeless P6040. I, I never somehow understood this, why to separate this uh, professional use from the residential use. Since I, I have been always a guy who is very keen of whatsoever ugly looking things and, and things which are working well, they are speaking for, to, for me than the, than the well shaped things. So in this, uh, this uh, process after 6040, the dialogue with uh, like heavy users of the speakers and, and they need to be rectangle ones. We need to fit them well to the wall. That was very understandable and, and I was also for it. But then when all these performance results from this a bit softer and rounder case were available, we just had to go to that direction. We had to follow what was like a real and, and true. And, and luckily, Genelec and we all we were brave enough to go for this direction and, and try it. They are not rectangular ones anymore. They are not fitting ex exactly to the geometry of the given space. They need a bit more space around them, but that is only good for the audio. There, there has to be space around the speakers. And somehow this shape <laughs> gives this space. 6040 used to be a bold speaker and 6040 is bold speaker even today. Thank you.